teacher, what shall I do to inherit eternal life? What is written in the law? How do you read it? You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, and with all your soul, and with all your strength, and with all your mind, and mostly your neighbor as yourself. You have answered correctly. Do this and you will live. And who is my neighbor? A man was walking down the street peacefully. And he fell among robbers. Who had beaten the man and leaving him half dead. Now by chance, a priest was going down that road. And when he saw him, he passed by on the other side. So likewise, a Levite, when he came to the place and saw him, he passed by on the other side. But a Samaritan, as he journeyed, came to where he was, and when he saw him, he had compassion. He went to him, bound up his wounds, brought him to an inn, and took care of him. He took out two denarii and gave them to the innkeeper. Take care of him, and whatever more you spend, I will repay you when I come back. Which of these three do you think proved to be a neighbor to the man who fell among the robbers? The one who showed him mercy. You go and do likewise. To learn more, read the actual parable in Luke chapter 10 verses 25 through 37. Now a woman had ten coins, however, one of them is missing. If a person doesn't light a lamp or sweep the house, how can they find the coin diligently? After she has found it, she calls together her friends and neighbors to celebrate the coin that she had once lost. Just so, I tell you. There is joy before the angels of God over the sinner who repents. Read the actual parable in Luke chapter 15 verses 8 through 10. Jesus, please tell my brother to divide our father's estate with me. <gasps> Friend, who made me a judge over you to decide such things as that? Beware, guard against every kind of greed. Life is not measured by how much you own. Let me tell you a story. <laughs> A rich man had a fertile farm that produced fine crop. What should I do? I don't have room for all my crops. I know. I'll tear down my barns and build bigger ones. Then I shall have room enough to store all my wheat and other goods. Ah, my friend, you have enough stored away for years to come. I can eat, drink, and be merry. You fool, you will die this very night. Then who will get everything you worked for? Yes, a person is a fool to store up earthly wealth, but not have a relationship with God. Read the actual parable in Luke chapter 12 verses 13 through 21.
should always pray and never, ever give up. There was a judge in a certain city who don't believe in God nor care about the citizens. Please give me justice in this dispute with my enemy. The judge ignored her for a while. I'm an, I'm an atheist, atheist nor care, care about, about citizens, citizens, but this, this woman, woman is driving, driving me crazy. crazy. I'm going to I'm help, going her, help get her get justice, justice because she is bugging, bugging me with her constant, constant regrets. regrets. Learn a lesson from this unjust judge. Even he rendered a just decision in the end. So don't you think God will surely give justice to his chosen people who crowd to him day and night? <sighs> I tell you, he will grant justice to them quickly. But when the Son of Man returns, how many will he find on the earth who have faith in him? Read the actual parable in Luke chapter 18, verses 1 through 8.